What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Snipes here with TKO <laughs> Gaming and yes, we are here with your weekly episode of talk shit to the motherfucker agent of the nine bitches Yes, we are here guys and God look at this early ass upload time Thank God. I don't not have work in the morning. So I am very very happy about that guys. I get to put a video up Super early for you guys so you guys can wake up to this shit or if you're awake right now you get to see it One favor to ask if you do hate Zer as much as I do or if you like me, please do and Like this video if you don't like me dislike this motherfucking shit right now dislike the video I don't care as long as you guys enjoy the content. I am happy now um, The Zer videos have not been getting a lot of views compared to the other videos personally. I don't care yeah, I, I just want to put videos that you guys want to see so if you guys want this series to continue Then please do put it in the comments below and let me know what you guys want because I want I want to I want to produce What you guys want to see right? I don't want to just keep doing what I want and my subs don't enjoy it So without further ado, let's find out what this bitch has god damn it What the fucking fuck you motherfucking Oh, dude, you're such a bitch, sir. Uh, you're such a bitch. You're a bitch. I, I don't want to talk about your family. You're a bitch. I fucking hate you. I don't like you. This is some fucking bullshit, dude. What the fuck is this? Hard light? I'm going to put this hard light in your fucking ass, dude. Fuck you. Guys, this is... I think this is the worst Zer I've seen in a while, and Zer was like decent these past couple weeks. Ruin Wings, I have I've upgraded these all the way. I don't find these to be amazing, but I guess if you're running like Vanguard Rock Strikes, this could be something useful or like raids. Uh, don't touch me. You have um, what is these? Oh, these are the gauntlets for the Hunter, I believe, right? Um, yeah, you get invisible after someone hits you, which is pretty cool. I mean, I would I would get this if you guys don't have it. I already have it, though. Um, then you have the Heart of Praxic motherfucking fire. This shit right here, um, is alright. It's not that big of a deal for me. It's pretty rare drop is what people say, but hard light, guys. The, we're at a point in this game right now is you would only get a gun if you feel that... You don't have it and you want to collect it because that's what destiny's at. It's like a collecting thing now um, And you have an exotic chart, which uh, don't even worry about it You can dismantle your extra no land beyonds that you get because I've gotten like three guys I've, been, I've just side story. I was playing iron banner in three games Three out of the ten games of iron banner. I played I got the Jolder's hammer as a random drop It was weird as fuck and it's a great gun. So I'll have gameplay of that coming up for you guys uh, let's see here. Knucklehead radar. Stupid. Don't worry about it. Young Ahamkara spine. This shit right here looks so cool aesthetically. Look at this man. Look how fucking beautiful this shit looks. God, that's fucking nice. But it's stupid. I don't think it's that great of a thing. Insurmountable skull for it is good for the Titan class in terms of like raids and stuff. Uh, Crest of Alpha Loopy. I love this shit, dude. No matter what class you have, get something that revives teammates faster spawn more orbs i know you guys saw the trials of osiris stream and i know you guys are as hyped as i am i will be giving you guys the motherfucking best tutorials on that shit so please stay tuned because tko gaming is going to get much much bigger and your guys's continued support makes a big difference so thank you for helping this channel grow and if you guys want to know how to help it grow just share it with your friends that's it word of mouth hey Go tech out. Go tech out. Okay, fuck me. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, Heart of Praxic Fire. It's above. If you want to buy it, just buy it with strange coins because we have an excess supply of that shit. Void Fang Vestments. I fucking hate the Axion Bolt so much. That grenade chases me for a motherfucking marathon. I have to run around the whole map before that g grenade's like, okay, I'm going to stop chasing snipes. So if you're a warlock and you enjoy this shit, you get it. All right, you motherfucking get this shit. Uh, guns, I'm just going to say yes or no because, you know, a lot of these guns are, are redos. So I'll say yes if I would upgrade it or no if I wouldn't. Uh, bad Juju, yes, I would upgrade it. It's a good-ass motherfucking pulse rifle. Uh, I don't want to go do the bounty again. So yes, I would do that. 
Red Death, yes. Mita multi tool, no. Plus Zer, I think sold it last week. Invective, no. But the regen ammo could be a good perk in PvP, given that the uh, what's it called? Special ammo crates are so low, like they only give you like four shotgun bullets. Plancy, no. Let it drop. Pocket Infinity, no, let it drop and just fucking go, not drop, but go do the bounty. Uh, this shit has always been so fucking stupid. I don't know who the fuck would ever get a Plasma Driver or an Emerald Coil. What the fuck is this? And Heavy Ammo, stock up, motherfuckers. I hate you guys who do the Heavy Ammo glitch, even though I have like a couple of videos on that. But anyways, guys, this was a very, very late, I'm not used to staying up this late, you know, with my job and everything. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for shut shut the fuck up, Zer. No one's talking to you. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to shut the fuck up. Okay, I gotta stop buying things because he talks for no reason. But thank you guys so much for tuning in. And I really, really hope that you guys fucking put your middle fingers up to this guy and please do beatbox that like button. And I will be coming out with some more crucible gameplay for you guys, getting everybody hyped and pumped for the trials of Osiris and the fucking Iron Banner. I hope you guys are doing good. Let me show you guys what I bought, man. Let me show you guys. Let me show you guys. Let me show you guys. Oh, look at his helmet. Look at his helmet. Yeah, I know a lot of you guys. Let me know. Are you guys ranked four yet? How's your Iron Banner experience going? Are you guys experiencing the horrible lag fest? Because I am. This is just an added on thing to this video, guys. Um, you guys can exit out of the video if you don't care. I'm going to show you guys my setup for Iron Banner, exactly what I run, okay? I have Mask of the Third Man. I have this, which Iron Banner is a hand cannon fest. It helps me speed reload my hand cannons faster. And you guys can find this at Dead Orbit. Um, you can also find this at, like, a similar one at any faction. So just find a one that reloads hand cannons faster and get it. And then, uh, yeah, that's my setup right there. Uh, I don't, I, I interchange between this, the Thorn, and then the Vex. Those are my three guns. Depending on the map and depending on who we're playing, those will be the three guns. My secondary would be Fell Winters or Praetor's Revenge. Um, sometimes I go to the Icebreaker if I really need, like, a crucial situation. I need some sniping bullets to rock some heads, you know what I'm saying? Uh, Radagast Fury is my go-to. Make sure it has grenades and horseshoes, which is the early proximity detonation perk that you see right there. It's fucking phenomenal. And then Jolder's Hammer, uh, depending on what team we're playing. And look, this is another Jolder's Hammer, and I have two sitting in my vault, by the way. Um, this one had the best role, so I kept it. But yeah, there you go, guys. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I love you guys. Peace.